Hey guys, and happy Tuesday evening. So I thought I would take you guys along with me while I make dinner tonight. Tonight we decided we are gonna have chopped steak with some fried potatoes and a veggie. Last night we made soup, and then Brian took some of that soup with him to work this, today for lunch. So I thought we'd just kind of make something different tonight and maybe have soup tomorrow night. Um, that way we're not having like soup, 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 soup. So just a, enough of the soup already. So, and I don't want him to have soup for lunch and then soup for dinner again so I feel bad so I'm gonna go ahead and start getting some of the stuff ready like I need to chop some of the onions to put inside the, the for the um, chopsticks and I need to get out a veggie and I need to chop up some potatoes and yeah this is just my like let's get ready for dinner look this is my evening chillax it's 36 degrees outside cold and windy and it's actually getting chilly in the house too so I thought I needed to kind of get up off of the couch after I finished editing the other video for today and I decided that we're just, I'm just gonna go ahead and start making some of this dinner. So, this is what happens in the evenings. My makeup comes off, my hair comes back, I get jammies on, I'm wearing my pass holder shirt and some um, jammy bottoms. And yeah, let's go start making dinner for tonight. Alrighty, so I decided we're gonna have Brussels sprouts tonight. So these are steamables, but I'm wondering if I can put these in the oven and if they would be okay. Does it say it's a stove top, directions, microwave? I don't know, I'll figure it out. But if I have to steam them, I will. It's not like a big deal, they're still good. Um, here's my onion that I'm gonna chop up and I'm gonna chop up three of these potatoes because they're really small. So, and then I'm gonna have corn because I know Brian's not a big fan of Brussels sprouts. So I'll probably just do corn for him and I'll do the Brussels sprouts. But I'm gonna go ahead and wash these potatoes. Hard to that much. Putting on your blue dress Your hair falls perfect on your shoulders I notice how we both have gotten older and I can see that lonely place Looking at your weary face you Used to laugh at everything Remember all the games we played I remember them like they were yesterday So I've chopped up the onions. This is how big we like them because we know that they shrink a bit as well. So I just put a little bit of butter inside of the pan and I just put these onions inside of here and then I just turn the eye on and let these simmer and get brown and then I usually put the meat on top of those onions and let them cook. And then right now I'm just letting these potatoes sit here. I probably won't start those until about because those will take a while to cook and these are going to take a while to get brown anyway so I'm going to go ahead and get those browned up in the meantime I'm just going to sit here and wait until the last minute to cook the meat and my veggies Alrighty, so the onions are looking really good they still need to get a little bit more burnt because we both like burnt onions my potatoes I have started so I'm cooking those up which is really nice I've already put the corn over here in a pan and then I laid out my Brussels sprouts and my oven is preheating so I can put all of this stuff in very, very shortly and dinner is coming right along. So I went ahead and added the patties in there and I'm just gonna go ahead and let those cook on low for now and then I will turn those up the closer it gets to five o'clock. That way those are gonna be done before Brian gets home. Everything is pretty much done. I'm just waiting for the corn and my Brussels sprouts probably need to be turned around a little bit. We're also having some salad before our meal. So yum, 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 it's almost time to eat. Both liquids. 
Good morning, friends, and happy Wednesday. Today, I am at Target because I am on the prowl for some more of those cute little white ceramic houses. And I know that Target at the dollar spot has a bunch of them, or they did have a bunch of them, but I am just here to see if my Target still has them, and if they do, I'm going to grab some. And then while I'm here, I'm just gonna look around as well. So I thought I'd go ahead and take you guys along with me, and we can look around at Christmas stuff at Target. Let's go in. And they have them, yay, I'm so excited. So now how many do I want? All of them? Yes, please. They have a lot of pretty wreaths. A lot of things have been picked over too though. You can see empty spots everywhere. They have lots of pretty stuff though still, which is really nice. That one's $45. I love that, but 45 is a little steep for some wreaths. Very pretty though. Whoa, $30 for that? Oh no, it's $10. Like, whoa. Nice. They have these really cute flocked trees. These are $5. Those are great. I love those. And then they have smaller ones that are three. Those are really cute. I think I'm gonna get these two though. Nope, I'm gonna get these two. I'm gonna get these two. Very cute. The $3. So they do have the pine here and the Peppermint scent, which that one smells really nice. I actually really like that. It smells super good. I I think I ordered that though. I think I have that coming. So I'm not gonna get any just yet. But that stuff smells so good. Alrighty, so I'm out of Target and now I'm gonna stop in here at Michael's and just kind of take a look and see what they have. I was very successful with the little houses that I got, so I was very happy about that. And I haven't been in Michael's in quite some time, so I thought I'd go in here and check out some of the Christmas stuff that they have to offer. So it was a bust at Michael's. They had absolutely like nothing left. Everything was all picked through. All they had was like, what are they, little tweed things you can stick inside your tree. They had some of that left and some wreaths and, but they didn't have anything else. It was like all picked through. So it was a bust out Michael's. So I stopped off at Starbucks before I headed home so I can get a Starbucks and then go home because that's what I'm doing today. I'm just going back home. I just wanted to run out to Target really quick to get a few things, paper plates, Kleenexes, and those little houses, of course. And now I'm gonna grab a coffee and I'm heading home. Simple, simple, easy day. And it's like 32 degrees outside. It's cold and it's windy, still very, very windy, like it was the other day. And <clears throat> I'm just like, I'm ready just to go home and stay home and be warm and cozy in the house because that's what today is, a nice, warm, cozy home day. So that's what I'm gonna go do. As soon as I get home, I'll show you guys what I picked up at Target, and then I'm gonna get started again. More decorating that has to be done. More decorating. Alrighty, so I thought I'd go ahead and show you guys a few of the things that I picked up at Target. I picked up some new stockings for me and Brian because we've had ours for so long that I really, really like these ones. And so I picked these ones up, obviously, a for me, B for Brian. I picked up some batteries because you guys know the other day I could not find mine. So I'm gonna go use these and plug my lights in in my bedroom. I picked up another one of these cute little card holder, card clips thing. These are so cute. I have one and I needed another one. So I picked another one up. These are only like five bucks. These are so cute. Perfect little gifts too, like stocking stuffers for friends or grab bags or white elephant gifts. So yeah, I love that. Picked up some paper plates and some Kleenexes since we are both kind of snotty still. Um, I picked up um, some Downy Unstoppables. I picked up some more of these cute little Christmas trees. I think these were, um, yeah, $5 over in the Christmas section. Super cute, love these things. I just love putting them everywhere. I picked up two of these cute little white flocked trees. These were also over in the Christmas section. They were $3. I picked up some M&Ms because I love having, having M&Ms laying throughout the house during the holidays, as you guys can see right there. So I always put these um, out. I picked peanut milk chocolate and peanut butter. I love these two. I'm not a big fan of these because I don't like nuts. Um, but these two I love so much. So these are always fun. And then I picked up some of these Hershey Kisses. These are 
for our stockings. I fill my stocking up too. <laughs> um, and I always put stuff in Brian's stocking. I picked up a card for my kid. So I'll put a gift card in there for him. I have this cute little Christmas sign that I picked up in the dollar spot. It was $3. Love that. And then as you guys saw, I picked up four of these houses, which are, they are just stinking adorably cute. Absolutely cute love these things. They are just so perfect for around the house for the holidays. And that is it for my Target haul. And I will check back in with you guys a little bit later. Let me get some of this stuff put away and I'll check back in a little bit. Bye. Alrighty. So I put the batteries in my little garland in my bedroom. I'm probably going to end up changing this because the, it's that LED lights and I hate those things. Those are so bad. But anyway, this is what the garland looks like with the lights in it. And yeah, see, some of them are like twinkly. Some of them are twinkling. I guess this thing can change. So you can push the button and it's got like eight different settings on it. Oh, brother, that's so busy for me. I like just it to be still. I don't like it to be some of them say slow glow. See, they have eight different, oh, nine different settings. Oh, nine is off. Okay. So one is combination in waves, se se sequential, slow glow, chasing, flashing, slow fade, twinkling, steady on. So eight is steady on. So hopefully I have it on eight. So yeah. Oh, well, that'll work for now until I maybe get some new ones. I don't know. I might just leave it for this year since it's already up there and I don't want to have to make another mess. So... Oh, that's just what it's going to have to be probably. But anyway, I think it turned out great. I like it. It's so pretty and I'm glad that I got it done. So yes, next step, foyer. Alrighty guys. So Brian came home for lunch. Um, he had to go do a demo this morning on his software. And so he had to drive past the house anyway to get back to work. So he just decided to stop off and have lunch. So I made him a quick sandwich and we just enjoyed lunch together and he went up and looked for my wreaths that I cannot find. So I have one more spot that I'm going to go look and if I can't find my Christmas wreaths, I don't know where they're at. This is so bizarre. When you have so much stuff, like things get tussled and ugh, I just don't know. And we took everything out of the attic. So I know it's not in the attic because he just went back up there to look. So I'm going to have to go look upstairs and they might be underneath the bed up there. I don't know. But um, anyway, I am, I finished up my foyer. Well, I finished up that table, excuse me, in my foyer. Foyer is not done yet. So I'm just now trying to get that, you know, in a position that I like it. And I've done it about 50 times until I like it. And I think right now I'm liking it. And I may decide no. But right now I'm liking it. So that's just the way it's going to stay for now. And I'm going to sit down for just a quick second and try to think of where I'm going to look for my wreaths too. <clears throat> and see if they're upstairs. And, uh... Yeah, other than that, that's about it for right now. For right now. It's only one o'clock, so yay. On this cold December day, we are on our merry way. Song, barreling through the snow Bells are jingling, snowflakes tingling Rudolph knows where to go On this cold December day I am piloting my sleigh The work to be done on my Christmas run Is the most tired chore No girl or boy so giddy up, root of my dear Eight pair of bananas Onward, seven girls Alrighty, so I've kind of, kind of started working on my tablescape in my dining room. It's coming along really well. I'm not exactly sure if this is the way that I'm going to leave it or not, but at least my dining room table is cleared off for the most part. And I'm very happy about that. But now that island in there is full of stuff. 
I just keep moving things from area to area to area to area and then I keep taking stuff upstairs too, stuff that I'm just not using um, at the moment. So that's what I'm doing and I'm sweeping the floors as I go around and yeah, oh my gosh. So I have two more days to tweak everything because Friday I will be doing my filming. So tonight Brian's gonna come home and hang up that shelf right here and so that's another place that I'm gonna like put some stuff on. So uh, yeah, <clears throat> so it's coming along very, very nicely. It's just taking forever, but I, there's, there's a method to my madness, there really is. But I'm just thankful that my dining room table is finally, finally coming together and it's actually getting cleared off, which is, Mickey Mouse, which is super nice. So I put the lights on my little tree here, which is great. Those are not like the normal lights that I like. And I need your guys' opinion. So should I leave the, the pillows like this where it says Mary on there or should I turn them around and leave them like this? I'm just curious because, I don't know, I kind of like them without the words because I really don't like the gold. So I'm thinking if I just flip them around, I feel better with them flipped around. I know, I kind of like them better that way. I'm asking your opinion. Um, what do you guys think? I like them this way because they just look nicer. I don't know, I don't like the gold. So I'm just gonna, I'll probably end up leaving them like this, but I just kind of thought, what would you guys do? What do you guys think? I like them like this. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna leave them like that. Okay, and I think that's about it. I have towels that I've got to fold up now and some shirts that I have to hang up. So I'm gonna end the vlog and that way I can get this up and edited because it is two o'clock. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, 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 oh,